Oh, Jennifer. Oh, Scarlet. Oh, Jennifer. Oh, Scarlet. Oh, Jennifer. Oh, Scarlet. Oh, Jennifer. Oh, Scarlet. Oh, Jennifer. Oh, ah! oh, you guys scared me. Jeez, you almost gave me a, a, a heart attack. Well, uh, anyway, uh, welcome to the Random Files. And, as always, I'm the Random Dude. Did you know that every year more than 10 people are killed by vending machines? Welcome to a new portion of the show called Rhyme Reviews. This is where I review a movie that I just saw completely in rhyme. Now let's talk about The Avengers. I saw it twice and I loved it! So, let's just begin the review. The Avengers is the film we've wanted forever. Now that we've seen it, man, was it clever. The writing, characters, comedy, and effects. This film is basically everything you'd expect. The plot involves Loki wanting to take over the world. He needs to cut his hair. He looks like a girl. But when he smiles, you know something's going down. Make sure this guy doesn't invade your town. Along comes Samuel L. Jackson with one eye. Rule number one, you don't f with this guy. He's joined by Agent Hill, a character like no other. Seriously? It's just Robin from How I Met Your Mother. They say it's time to put together this team. More than one superhero, this isn't a dream! Watching the Avengers assemble one by one. I mean, how can you not like this film? It's so much fun! When I first saw Iron Man in 2008, I knew the Avengers would be worth the wait. Robert Downey Jr. can do no wrong. His performance, as always, was without a doubt strong. And speaking of strong, the Hulk was damn crazy! I'm glad they wrote his character not half-assed or lazy. Mark Ruffalo played it calm, not giving in to so much attention. Because with all these heroes, there was a lot of tension. I'll salute Captain America any time, any day. Even if his costume does look a little gay. But then again, these are superheroes. We'll tolerate it. Joss Whedon's direction made this film look sophisticated. Chris Evans really conveyed these true internal conflicts. Stuck in a new time period? Yeah, I would have been ticked. We also have the God of Thunder, the one they call Thor. He's the guy to hire if you're gonna go to war. And then we have the drop-dead gorgeous Black Widow. All I can say is, will you marry me, ScarJo? Your tight suit, your red hair, your kick-ass moves. Let me take you out, buy you jewelry, cars, shoes. But no, she's got the secret hots for Hawkeye. Don't touch his bows and arrows, don't even try. With the stuff they could do with a movie like this, I'm relieved it didn't turn into a huge pile of piss. They took time with the story, the effects were top-notch, Whenever this movie is playing, just sit down, shut up, and watch. The character development was strong for a simple story, but considering how it worked, it's pure Marvel glory. So I love this film. It could do no harm. I'm the random dude, and I'm going to get some shawar -ma. Scarlet, be mine. Oh no, no, Jennifer, be mine. No, Scarlet, be mine. No, Jennifer, be mine.